you find yourself more interesting than the other person. And it's very human. Good evening, everybody. So today is August the 7th. We are doing Robert Greene's The Daily Laws. And I stitched Robert Greene. So y'all know who is the writer of this book. Um, he's speaking about self-interest. And that's what today's daily law is. So I'm going to get right into it. Consider their self-interest. Most men are so thoroughly subjective that nothing really interests them but themselves. Arthur Schopenhauer. The quickest way to secure people's minds is by demonstrating as simply as possible how an action will benefit them. Self-interest is the strongest motive of all. A great cause may capture minds, but once the first flush of excitement is over, interest will flag, unless there is something to be gained. Self-interest is the soldier foundation. The causes that work best use a noble veneer to cover a blatant appeal to self-interest. The cause seduces, but the self-interest secures the deal. Daily law, show people what's in it for them. So this comes from the 48 laws of power, law 43, work on the hearts and minds of others. So uh, the 48 laws of power, I think that was his first like masterpiece. And um, he wrote those laws because he wrote those laws for the the underdog or people that are workers or and he he was working in Hollywood at the time um and he saw how you know sick and all twisted it was and how you had to maneuver so he wrote the 48 laws of power to help people to maneuver with the monsters of society so um the monster is power so that's what he's showing you in dissecting um, the laws so that you can get through this this life in this world with with power being the the struggle that we're against so i hope you i hope you enjoyed our august the 7th reading thank you for joining make some comments um listen to robert green he's got some uh, um, podcasts that I listen to that are on YouTube and uh, there's a lot of videos all over um, TikTok with the 48 Laws of Power so y'all listen to that man he is he's so humble but so smart and I just admire the hell out of him he is just the best the best writer um, I, I love listening to him so go listen to him y'all have a good night